Hey everybody, it's Patricia and welcome back to my channel. It's time to do an empties video. And boy, do I have the empties. I've got an empty trash can to put things in as we go through. So wow, this is for the month of September. And I'm like, wow, some months I feel like I don't have hardly any empties. And this month it's like, whew. Uh, I have quite a few candles. This month I'm gonna make you wait till the end. So if you're not wanting to see everything else, just scroll ahead, just fast forward. I don't have, I have a few things, but it's not outrageous. That's not candles, but anyway. Let's just jump right in. First, I used up another Vitafusion Melatonin. I love this, they're gummies. Uh, these are the sugar-free ones. They're peach flavor. I pick them up at Kroger. Uh, it says Awake Refreshed. They do put me to sleep. They do not keep me asleep, but they do put me to sleep. So I do, I like these. I recommend them. Now from my Shop Miss A haul, I have a microfiber hair towel packet here. I just wanted to tell you guys, these are amazing. I bought two. I'm gonna show those plastic things. But uh, these, I will buy more. If I need, I don't really need more. I think two is enough to rotate back and forth. These are great. Highly recommend, especially if you've got long hair like I do. Highly recommend, very absorbent. I used a pack of uh, makeup removing towelettes. The reason I really put this one in here, this is Aldi brand. And I swear I would put it right up there with Noxzema. I was really shocked. I used them on my face and they were great. Aldi brand, cheap. What, a dollar something I think maybe? And it was a big pack, how many was in here? 25, but I mean, for Aldi prices, yeah. Highly recommend. Okay, I have a couple of face masks. Uh, this multivitamin kiwi mask. This was okay. It was nice. It was a basic face mask, uh, sheet mask. I, I didn't have any issues with it. It was fine. Now, this Global Beauty Care Firming Spa Treatment Mask. I joked in my shop miss A that it looked like... Um, Phantom of the Opera, you do get all sides. I couldn't keep this thing on my face. It would not, it adhered to my face immediately, but when it started drying, it's just, it, I wouldn't buy any more of these. Did not enjoy trying to wear this. Uh, yeah, it, it wouldn't stay, it wouldn't stay in place. I say no to that. Okay, let's go, I've got some little packets in here. Uh, I have, this Kate Somerville Wrinkle Warrior. Uh, it's a serum, moisturizer and serum. Nice. I like Kate Somerville's products. I would highly recommend this. I enjoyed using that sample. Uh, Kate Somerville Eradicate. I do like Eradicate as a nice uh, scrub. I do enjoy that one. Highly recommend. And then Diva Curl Super Cream Coconut Curl Styler. I think I'm gonna to have to buy this. I've been trying um, like cheaper versions. Diva uh, Curl's amazing. I liked it. Uh, I think I'm, I'm gonna add that to a list of something I really need. It did make my, my curls spring up, my natural curls. So I might have to invest in that. This came in an Ipsy uh, Myel Sugar Scrub. Uh, I'm sure the full size version is much easier. This was so hard to squeeze out the product. I did enjoy the product itself as a, a body scrub. Uh, I couldn't smell it hardly at all though. So that, I was really excited because I can't remember what the scent was, but I couldn't smell it. It was okay. I personally would not purchase it. Uh, I don't know how it is to, uh, use it uh, to buy the full size but I have a little juice beauty stem cellular cellular anti-wrinkle boost serum I do like this I've had several samples of this and I do enjoy using this serum it's good and then this Vichy mineral 
$89. It's, I think, like a toner. It's a gel, water gel. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I, I enjoyed using that. It was pretty neat. Um, my Lumify. I used up a Lumify. These are the only eye drops that take the redness out of my eyes. I have, um, I have glaucoma. And also, I have busted capillaries in my eyes. I, I'm very prone to... I haven't... Look on wood. I haven't, it hasn't happened in a while, but I will wake up and my whole eye be red where a busted capillary and it's it's hard for it to get back to normal and I do have very prominent uh, veins in my eyes that don't totally go away but if I don't use a drop my eyes look red almost all the time so Lumify is the only thing that works I've tried other things Visine stuff that didn't work I have three uh, perfume samples this one is Fame by Paco Rabanne. It was nice. Uh, I don't feel the need to buy a bottle. Chloe. I've had Chloe before. Nice. I don't need to buy a bottle. And then, what was this one? I might have to dig out the... Coach Dreams Sunset. This was okay. This one is one where I don't think I'd go out and buy a bottle. But if someone offered it to me, I would be very appreciative. Yeah, it it gives me it gives me a summertime feel to me. I don't know if that makes sense, but I liked it. Uh, I have uh, in here just three old sponges because I got a couple new ones, and then I don't know if you guys saw this is my Huda Beauty, my Huda uh, Buff and Blend face. I paid a lot of money for that brush for it to do that not happy it's in the trash now let's get into some oh there's one more little thing in here uh, and this was my Kylie Jenner lip liner in head over heels that sucker dried out the the stick came out the liner yeah it, but it's old so not not that surprised now I've got some candles here and let me see how I'm going to show them to you because there's some cool stuff here. And then some stuff that's... Okay. First, I went to a uh, wax melt pumpkin s'mores. Oh, this smells so good. It smells so good. I got the full size. Here we go. I'll go ahead and show you. I found it in the full size. Oh. Mmm. smells so good. This, to me, even would go into Christmas, I think. It, it's, and let me, they, they now put the notes on the Aldi candles. Uh, pumpkin puree, dark cocoa graham cracker. Smells, smells yummy. My town does not recycle glass. So I will throw this away. But um, yeah, and unfortunately with Aldi candles, they don't keep them all the time. They get in an order. When they're gone, they're gone. You may see them again in some other form later on, but probably not. It is what it is. So, there we go. Uh, the plain glass jars are $4.49. I'll try to remember prices. This one was also a plain glass jar. $4.49. Pumpkin and oak. And this nice orange. Yeah, this smells good. I liked this one. Uh, the scent of this is sun-touched citrus. Oh, they're turning into Bath and Body Works, aren't they? Pumpkin puree and amber. Sun-touched citrus. Unlike the citrus that's grown in the dark, I guess. It smells good. I, I liked it. I, I did enjoy that one. I'm not saving those jars. I don't need them. Uh, also in the plain glass, I've got pink peppercorn and sea salt. And this is like a a gray black wax yeah to me this smells um more masculine but i did enjoy it it's mineral springs sea salt and pink peppercorn it i did i did like this i did like it a lot so there's that one those are all sell for 4.49 next i have the last one of these 
I cleaned out the other two jars. It has a wooden lid. This one is called Dreamer. And it burned all the way down. Three wick. All the way. Uh, shoot. I gotta have magnifying glass for this one. It's a little smaller. Lavender, eucalyptus, and mint. When I cleaned out the other two jars, this white is painted on the inside and it scratched up really bad. And I know it has a wooden lid. I don't know of any need for the wooden lid. God, I'm not going to be a hoarder. I'm just going to, it's going to go away. Don't be a hoarder. Patricia, don't hoard it. You don't have an idea for it. Okay, these are, yeah, these are also from Aldi. All that's from Aldi. This is from Aldi. I can't remember what these cost. I'm thinking they were two, three dollars. They're the smaller jars. The jar is actually amber color. This one is falling leaves. Let me grab this. Falling leaves, patchouli, leather, and cedar wood. It definitely smells very masculine to me. This jar I am going to keep. I don't think that's painted. I hope not. I think it's an actual amber jar. So I'm going to do that one. And then also in that same line was Harvest Bliss. Now there was several scents in this line and there were some I just didn't like. Yeah, it's one. Okay, sorry I had to change batteries. But let's get back to Harvest Bliss. Um, did I read the notes for you? I can't remember. No, I did not. So this one, the notes are jasmine, peach, and musk. To me, I guess it's the musk. It's giving it a little bit of a more of a masculine scent. Uh, it was okay. I liked it all right. These are these two were not my favorite scents, but I liked them okay. And I am going to keep the jar and see if I can clean it out. Now, I've got some cute stuff here. I've got three candles left to our Huntington home and one I picked up at Marshall's. I'll show you the Marshall one first and then we'll finish up with two more from Audi. Uh, this is the only one I have that's not Audi. Pumpkin spice and butter croissant. Look at this. It's like a drink cup. It smells you can smell that buttery smell like a pumpkin baked good and I paid $4.99 I don't know if you can see that that part you might not be able to see $4.99 at Marshall's anyway but it's I guess I'll use it for decor yeah it doesn't say anything on the bottom it smells delicious I just thought it was so cute and it was a week that I didn't have, I hadn't purchased a candle and I was at Marshall's and I'm like, okay. I usually purchase candles every week. And yeah, so <laughs> it smells delicious. It smells buttery. Buttery, it actually smells a little syrupy, like maybe a waffle kind of smell rather than a croissant. That's That was really nice. I'm gonna check Marshall's more for candles, especially sometimes Kroger, or not Kroger. Kroger has candles, not my favorite. Sometimes Audi doesn't um, have candles. And I go through, oh, okay, there's no candle here. <laughs> so anyway, these next two are Darlin. Darlin. Um, this one is fall morning. Look at that. I have from Audi several years ago an acorn jar but my acorn was all gold so this is pretty cool and I like this would make a great gift it's got a little tag on it um it the thing with this one is it doesn't give me sense it just says fall morning so I don't know the the sense um it does give me like that kind of a leaf smell like leaves trees leaves I don't know how to explain it it does kind of have that smell when calling it fall morning is a pretty good title it has one of those like wood wicks in it as well 
Uh, I did enjoy this. I think this was $6.99. Uh, but yeah. And definitely, I'm keeping the jar. And then this last one. Ah, this last one is called Mahogany Woods. And again, I don't have any fragrance notes. But look. It's a mushroom. It's all ceramic. All ceramic. This one smells very masculine to me. I am not sure of the notes. Very masculine. It, again, had that wood wick kind of thing. I just thought, wow, is this not cute? It's supposed to be a mushroom. It does give mushroom vibes. But I'm actually thinking about painting white dots on it. Just for fall decor. But is this is not, not the cutest. $6.99 at Aldi. So that's it. That's everything I got. Great, sorry about my phone. Great, great week for, or month for candles. I've got some more cute ones in the wings and some more fun ones uh, that'll be coming up. You will see in my October empties. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, I would love it if you would subscribe. Any questions or comments, just leave them down below. Again, guys, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you next time.